from the Oval Office, a special address by the President of the United States. My fellow Americans, we have endured great suffering in the past little while. Terrorism on American soil, the anthrax scares, Melissa Etheridge singing God Bless America at every World Series game. Well, me and Vice President Cheney are deeply concerned. Right, Dick? Big time. The capital, Kabul, in Afghanistan has been taken. Now, some of you may not know exactly where Afghanistan is. Well, neither do I. <laughs> but to get there, you go to Italy and make a riot. <laughs> Folks, I assure you, your country is in good hands. There is no reason to worry about the safety of your leaders. Big time. <laughs> I'll handle this, Dick. Let me bring you up to speed. Under my direction, authorities have frozen the assets of the following fronts for terrorist cells operating right here in America. Specifically, death to the American Infidel Dogs Convenience Store. Liberation Front for Al-Qaeda Bake Shop. And Taliban fake passports in an hour. But make no mistake, there are still a lot of questions to be answered. Exactly who are these people who put America on guard? Who put the money into this evil operation? Well, let's roll. Or better yet, let's rock and roll. Who put the bomb in the bomb, the bomb, the bomb? Who put the band in the tally, tally, band, band? Who put the bull in the cabal, cabal, cabal? Who put the dot in the alley, alley, K dot? Who is that man hiding in a cave in Afghanistan? Make no mistake, Al Qaeda. George Dub is not afraid of you. Yeah. Like the saying goes, war is party. Osama, 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 ding dong, and I knew he was an evil doer. So now he'll hear me singing, come Mr. Taliban, tally me bin line. You are so full of manure. So... Who put the bomb in the bomb, ba bomb, ba bomb? Who put the ban in the tally, tally ban? Osama is that dork. He's done sticking a fork. He won't have a chance when we put anthrax in his pants. Good night and God help America.